Tom, this is Mr. Cuffrey here for the Just Ice League. I'm here at Curcon 2016 where I have the opportunity to get my hands on the Castle Kickstarter 2 by Miniature Building Authority. We're just going to do a quick run through of uh, some of the pieces that they're going to be adding. Um, those of you who backed the last Kickstarter, this is all going to be compatible. It's uh, all going to be uh, modular just like the last one. So let's have a look. As you can see here, this is one of the 45 degree towers. Uh, it ex matches perfectly with some of their previous releases. What's really neat about this, it's much bigger than the other 45 degree tower. It's got this central area, the central tower. Top comes off. And then you have the, the stair built in, which is kind of cool. It's beautiful. And there's the inside. All right, so here you can see that they obviously listened to everyone commenting on the last Kickstarter because you've got the uh, corner tower, the 90 degree tower, with the hoarding built in. It's beautiful top, conical top. The hoarding, of course, comes off. It's, in a, it's got a removable piece here so you can get to the figs inside and see what's going on, as well as it comes off with the complete top and you have the, the detailed interior with the walls and everything like that, just like the 45 degree tower that we're all familiar with. All right, so what's really cool is this is another one of the integrated buildings, the bakery. You can see it goes right along with all the other pieces, which is fantastic. Uh, this is one of the, you know, you got the, the drawbridge, one of the previous releases, the last Kickstarter. Mary's up there perfect. Uh, what's interesting is go ahead and bring the camera in a little closer here. You can see it's got the upper level, just, uh, you know, troops passing through, as well as the lower level down there. And what's pretty cool is of course you got the double doors there for access below, as well as the little detail, which is, this is what I love about NBA, is you got the little detail here. Okay, so you can see here the little detail on the side of the bakery with the wood pile. So it's like those little things that really make it pop and make it uh, kind of break up the, the, you know, the monotone look of a, of, a, of a castle wall, give you some of that really great detail. So this is the stable. Again, you can see the detail, this little piece on the side, on the outside of the wall, absolutely wonderful. And then if you know, got the, like all their buildings, has a removable floor, I love the way this works right in with, here's that other 45 degree tower. You can see the difference in the sizes. We'll show that in a second. Here, removal roof. And again, this is, these are things I like to point out, which makes MBA just like the best. Is again, you have a detail there, a little water trough built into the building. It's, it's integrated, it's part of, part of the building. It comes painted just like the rest of the building. So, you know, you gotta water your horses at some point. So it's all right there. So here, I just wanna take a second and show, you can see here, here's the difference in the 45 degree tower. So the new one that's been coming out in the castles too, Kickstarter. So it's much bigger, it's a larger footprint, but you still have the basic, the same basic angle. So you can plan your castle accordingly. No. Okay, so again, what came up during the castle, the first castle Kickstarter, I remember people were really excited, they wanted more hoarding. And they're, of course, they're doing exactly what they want, you know, so that's not a surprise there. So you can see they, they've got the, the hoarding piece that goes on the straight wall. And you look at it from behind. The lid, uh, the roof comes off, I should say. So you have access to, uh, you know, the models inside. And then they've also made it like a little serving tray style attachment. Again, what's fantastic about them is A, the quality. You can see how thick the material is. Um, it's made for gamers, by gamers. So you have, this will accommodate like all your standard one inch stand, 20 millimeter stands. Um, so you can get your models in there, get them in the fight and, and not spend all your time dismantling terrain and trying to just to move one guy an inch, you know? So it's really fantastic stuff. All right, and this is, okay, now this is obviously the, the premier pieces that they're releasing with Castle Kickstarter 2. Um, and this is what I love about uh, NBA. As I mentioned earlier, I'll mention it again, um, is it's for gamers by gamers. So they have this tall tower. You say, oh, there's no way. How is this going to work in a game? Well, they thought ahead. The whole top section comes off, beautifully detailed, very sturdy. The lid comes off. The both floors are accessible. You come up and look down the middle, boom. Again, all three floors here are accessible all the way through to the bottom where the gates are and the uh, portapus. Absolutely fantastic stuff. Beautifully made, beautifully detailed. And sturdy, sturdy, sturdy. My two and a half year old daughter plays with this stuff at my house and, and she doesn't even, she hasn't scuffed the mark on one. Okay, so answering us on the Kickstarter, we came up during the last Kickstarter and, and you know they listened to us. They're giving us a full range of siege equipment and defensive equipment. 
Uh, you got the little tunnel entrance, which is just absolutely awesome. Uh, but probably me, I know this is all great. My favorite thing is the ladders because like some of you out there might have had the same problem I had is finding ladders that look good on their walls. I found some are too short, some like just the scale looks wonky, but these are absolutely a perfect match for the wall. So you do that little hasty assault with your troops and try to try to take uh, take the defenders. And then finally, I would like to you know we'll highlight the step up uh, wall. That what this is this is probably I know everything else is beautiful, but this is the part I'm probably the most excited about because what it does is it allows us guys who maybe have like some of the smaller the the, the original castle Kickstarter kind of work our way up to the bigger castle by using our existing you know standard size walls and then go to the tall walls and then maybe get like an octagon tower. This could actually probably work as a, a small keep by itself. It's just so beautifully detailed. There you have it, y'all. That's just a fast look at the Initial Building Authority Castles 2. I can tell you, as a collector of MDA for years, I've always been thrilled with their product. They haven't disappointed. They've listened to what we've had, our feedback, uh, our requests, and they're really going to come out of the game strong on this one. I really feel this is another kick, just another successful Kickstarter for them. So, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. Aim well.